We're all going on a summer holiday. No more working for a week or two. Fun and laughter on a summer holiday. No more worries for me or you. So you've done the easy bit. You've found out where you want to go on holiday. You've picked a destination. You've paid for it. You've been to the shops and you've got yourself a new bathing suit. The only thing to do now is get packing. Get Packing is a multiplayer puzzle game that will get your neurons thinking about your next vacation spot. Travel to 30 dream destinations, Hawaii, Ibiza, Bora Bora, and plenty of others. But first, you need to close your suitcase. Get Packing is a delightfully simple puzzle game which will drive you absolutely bananas. It is just... It is one of those great little puzzle games where you think you've got everything right in that last little piece, that last single flip-flop. Why are you only packing one flip-flop? I don't know, ask the game designer, but that one little flip-flop won't fit in the case. And the case will close, but it'll be open. It'll be open by a fraction. It'll be open by a fraction. And unlike a holiday case where you can sit on it and then gaffer tape it up, that doesn't count in this game. You can't do that. You have to close the case properly, otherwise you haven't won the game and you haven't done the puzzle! I'm looking at you, back of the box. Yeah, you, back of the box. You said, get your item, put them in, and close the case. It's not that simple. It's not as simple as closing the case, picking the item, closing the case. Blah, 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 blah. It's not. It's not that easy. And I love it. I love it. It's so good. So in the box, obviously, you have your destination cards. Here they are. These are your destinations of your lovely holidays. Whether you're going to Madagascar, or there, or Goa, or Sydney, or Cuba, or Rio de Janeiro, or Mexico. I'm not going to do 30 of these, but there's loads of them, and it's really good. Because there are all the different things you have to take. So, for example, if you were going to go on a holiday to Egypt, you would require to take a rubber ring, one pair of glasses, some bug spray, a single teddy bear, a t-shirt, some swimming trunks, a flipper de flop, and one board. But one flip flop, evidently. Um, and then that, then that, those things you have to get from these plastic components. Here's a component. Here is your singular flipper de flop. Here is your ball. Here is your rubber ring. So, once you've got all your components together, you get your little case. Here it is. Hello, I'm the case. Sometimes I close, most of the time I don't. And Craig gets frustrated and he hurts me. Shut up, Case. No, you don't like it. You hurt me. Do you quiet, Case? I'm not taking it from you. <laughs> Ignore him. Ignore the Case. <sighs> the rules are really simple. Um, everyone takes it in turns, gets their pieces, closes the box. I mean, I don't know why the instruction manual is so thick. Um, I mean, fundamentally, that's it. That's the uh, that's the map. That's that's the game. The, the the lovely instruction manual here of how to play the game. Get your bits, put them in the case, go. Give you instructions for the solo variant or any other variant if you're playing with children and you want to make it more difficult for the adults. Then there's a map. There's a map of all the destinations and how difficult the cases are to fill. Um, it's a map. It's quite, it's quite mappy, really. Um, and then you, you, the answers at the back of the instruction manual, which is fine, um, I guess. Uh, but yeah, I, it's, it's just a great little game that just will take your time, and it will be one of those tricky ones. And the best thing, if you've got kids, give them the pieces, give them the case, sit them in a the corner, they'll be quiet for days. Love it. Thanks for watching. It's a bit of a shorter episode, I know, but get packing. Buy it. It's really good. See you later.